Okay, something interesting came up in the comments recently and I noticed that I haven't worked on odd even functions for a while. I did a quiz about a year and a half ago and there was a comment from Cellcat about breaking up a function using odd even decomposition. Okay, so we have the formula here for even odd decomposition and this is actually really interesting because it's so easy to use. We've got a way to just automatically break this up and what we're saying here is this part is one function that's gonna be even and this part is gonna be another function that's gonna be odd. And so we can take any function and break it up this way and get an even and odd part. You may notice for some functions you end up getting a zero and it's not that interesting, but you can just easily follow this and break up any function this way. And maybe one of the more straightforward examples is just e to the x. So what we're gonna do is we wanna break up e to the x and we're gonna see that it turns into cosh x plus cinch x, where cosh is gonna be our even function and cinch is gonna be our odd function. So let's see how this works. We're gonna have, we'll start with our e to the x. And we're just gonna follow along with this. So I should just make it clear, this is going to be our f of x, our f of x is going to be e to the x. And then so let's just find out what f of minus x is. Well, it's just going to be e to the minus x. So now we have everything to just plug in here. So our f of x again is e to the x, and this is going to be e to the minus x. And then coming over to this part, we're going to have one half. And again, we have e to the x, but there's a minus sign here. So we have minus e to the minus x. But I can just take my one half and write it. In the denominator, we can write this over two, and I'll write this one over two, but this is actually the definition of cosh x, and this is the definition of cinch x, and cosh is an even function, cinch is an odd function, so this is really all there is to it. So I'm going to do a few more of these, and they'll get a little harder, but not too much harder, so we'll stop it there. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a great day.